Hey guys, and welcome back to Crow Country. When we last left off, we finally got into Crow's office. And, uh, well, we uh, certainly discovered some things, didn't we? Now, we have an electronic panel. And one second, my phone is going. Okay, and we're back. So, we have a control panel here. Control room, no unauthorized entry. Well, we're going to be authorized, or unauthorized, I should say. There's also a code here. 9218. Okay, maybe that might be worth keeping uh, in our memory for now. So, this is Crow's uh, little secret back here. All right, let's have a little look, see what we've got. It's a monitor. It's a video from a security camera. Wait a second. That's my car. It looks like Arthur is still inside. Arthur, can you hear me? Mara, is that you? I, I can't see you. Where are you? I'm in the control room, or in a control room. Control room? Is it cool? Yeah, it's really cool. I'm jealous. you got to go on a real adventure. Arthur, how are you feeling? N not great. Just stay there, okay? Mara, are you coming back? Are we going to leave? I'm going to say yes, we are. Sure. Yeah, I'll be back soon. Okay, good. Well, we're going to do our best. And what the hell is that? It's a video feed from a security camera. It's showing something on the screen. It's moving. Let's talk to it. Hello? What are you? What do you want? It didn't respond. Hmm. All right, well, no time for tears, I guess. So let's try 92-18. Uh, ah, the cabinet opened. There's a lever inside. Well, let's give that a good old tug. And that has uh, turned on the power to all of the uh, elevators and pipes. Crow Country elevator power grid. All five lights are green. Excellent. Well, let's get out of here, shall we? Oh, hello. I guess it didn't like us having a chat with it. Right, this is going to get ugly. No matter. We've got the tools to deal with this thing. And that is the fourth and final optional boss. Yeah, not much to look at when you scrape them off your boot. Now, let's see what we've got in the trash. Nothing. Lovely. I'm locked in. To release the security gate, set floor panel code to 123456. Ha. Huh. Some kind of electronic gate. Well, that's interesting. It's a screen. 413. There's a button underneath. Well, let's reset that. Now, if we check out the floor here, we can see the sides of dice. Let's go for one. Two. Three, four, five, and six. And with all of the die inputs put in, we can get out of here again. All right. And we're going to pretend that we didn't see that. All right. Let's grab the shotgun shells. Why don't you come with me? No. I don't want to know what's down there. I'll wait here. Understandable. All right. So we have a rough idea of what we need to do. Now we just need to do it. So let's head on through and go to our last little area to explore. And that is back in the underground or underwater kingdom. Now, was there anything left inside I'm sure there was like some shotgun shells or something that we didn't pick up is that just my mind playing tricks on me it could be 
All right, well, I guess not. I thought there was still some stuff there that we didn't grab, but whatever. Whatever, yo. Well, this place is still empty. And that rain is starting to come down pretty hard, huh? Well, no time to worry about that. Right. Hmm. Somebody's gone through here. And we have a control room. Staff only. Luckily, we have the golden key. It's unlocked. <gasps> and we can also go to the seven seas, which was the room that was uh, covered in some sort of gas. But we don't have to worry about that now. Unfortunately, there's not a huge amount that we can do in here just yet. There's a med kit, but we don't have uh, any need for that just yet. Okay, let's get out of here. And there is a boat as well. You know, we may actually have to, before we do anything here, we might actually have to have a look at this. Ooh, the phone's going over the other side. Well, I get it all to myself. Nice. Well, Mara, this is fun, but I can't operate the ride controls from here. Yeah, that's a problem. So we're possibly going to need another person to help us with this. Well, we shall see who we can find around here. Ah, uh, there's some handgun bullets. And we are always in need for handgun bullets. Always. Oops. Try not to waste all of them. Hello? You're still alive. I know it's dangerous up there. A lot of them got out into the open. But I know you brought a gun. Have you been killing them, the guests? They're in no shape to continue living. The ones that emerged more recently, even more so. As I continued the root excavation, the guests became even less... Well, some of them aren't even bipedal anymore. It goes without saying that we cannot let them leave Crow Country. We cannot afford to let them infect anybody else. What are they? Who are they? They are irreversible. Oof. Okay, he's gone. So we know Mr. Crow is still alive. We just don't know where he is. Well, we're pretty sure he's down, deep down into the core. Can we get somebody to hook up the sprinklers in the theater to the main water supply? Currently, it's just hooked up to a water tank, but it's not airtight, so eventually it'll dry out. Yeah, that's how we uh, know to use the acid. Anyway, let's move on through here. Well, this place looks interesting. This is the loading bay. Plenty of ammo. Oh, that was nice. Huh. That's not great. Okay. I noticed there's an elevator behind the large crow. Does it go anywhere? Does anybody else use it? It always seems to be powered down. I figured it was broken, but somebody said there's a switch in the crow's office that turns it on. Well, we've, we've done that. So, some kind of diagram. Mm-hmm. We need to use a battery to put in the crow. Okay, I think I have it figured out. Bronze key, crank handle, ruby, chain, mask, trident, silver key, data disc, acid bottle fill, golden key, large battery, charge. What an ordeal. And that's kind of like a little bit of an Easter egg there. Um, it, yeah, that's basically the, uh, the workflow of the game. Okay, so before we have a look into the, in there, 
Let's go through here. And here we can see the root excavation process. Gold goes in that tube. And for some reason, they're putting the copper outer casing of the root in a big dumpster and burning it. I'm not really sure that's the best way of dealing with it, but what do I know? It's a dumpster. Whatever's in there, it's on fire. It smells bad. It's giving me a headache. Yeah, that's not fantastic. All right, we're full of shotgun shells. Okay. It's a computer screen. It's just a bunch of flickering numbers. I can't make sense of it. Okay, so interestingly, when we were um, down below, we didn't see much root extraction going on. I don't know whether it's been halted or those who have just restarted the process since we've left. Not really sure. All right, well, it's a large wooden box. Well, I think it's a shipping crate. Maybe I shouldn't. Well, let's open it. No time like the present. Oh. Hey, kid. Julie, what happened? I'll tell you if you help me out of this thing. Uh, of course. Let's get you out of there. Someone left her in there to die. That's interesting. Ugh, thanks for the help. How did you end up in the crate? Some guy grabbed me from behind and threw me in there. Some guy? Who was it? No idea. Didn't see his face. He had a real sweaty hands, though. Oh, gross. Yeah, not an especially enjoyable experience, all told. I wonder if it was Marvin. He looked like he'd be kind of sweaty. Marvin who? Oh, nothing. Don't worry. Just thinking out loud. I'm glad you're safe. Yeah, listen, that's twice you've helped me out now. Let me know if there's any way I can return the favour. Right, thanks, will do. Well, there is one thing she can do for us. Anything I can do for you? Uh, we can don't bother her or ask her for help. Actually, there is something. I need to get through the boat ride in the Ocean Kingdom area. The Seven Seas? Yeah, uh, I could use your help to operate the controls. Have you opened the door to the control room? Yeah, it's open. Nice work. I'll head to the control room, and you go to the boat boarding area. See you there. Now, if you hadn't already worked most of that puzzle out, she'll just wait there uh, until you actually need to use her. And if you've twigged that you need her, but you haven't opened that room yet, she will just say that, you know, there's that you need to actually open the door before she can get in. <clears throat> right. Let's go. Let's go take the ride of our life. You have to sit in the middle as well. If you try to sit anywhere else, no bueno. If I'm going to sit in it, I should sit in the middle. And there's Julie. I get it all to myself. Nice. Are you ready to go? Yeah, I think so. I can't guarantee this will be safe. Should I start the ride? Let's go. Start the ride, Julie. All right. I like these uh, boat rides, log flume type things. Unfortunately, we quickly come to the end of the line. The white whale is blocking the boat. If I remember it right, he's supposed to move out of the way. But I think it's done manually from the control panel. I wonder why Julie didn't press the button. Yeah, I wonder why. All right, well, no point worrying about it yet. It's the biggest, most ornate switch I've ever seen. Oh, well, let's give it a tug. Looks like something out of the original Tomb Raider games. Okay. She's empty. Let's take a little look in this treasure chest. It's a control box. I mean, it certainly is a control box. Now, if I remember, I th 
think we need it to be on three. And if we come over this one, I think we also need this one to be on three. There we go. Right, now let's open her up and get that battery. Should I check inside? Open her up. This place has a really ominous sound uh, ambience to it as well. It's really freaking good. There's a battery. It's in fairly good condition. It is, but it's empty. All right, we don't need to open her up again. We already took the battery. Now, let's get out of here. Uh, well, that's not good. What's this? It's a blood stain. And these are Julie's glasses. What happened to her? Yeah, nothing good. Uh, what a shame. Anyway, let's go. So, we've got the battery. And we know where we need to charge the battery. It looks like it's stopped raining. Ooh. There are lots of dead guests. That's interesting. Very interesting. Oh, ooh, and they're dead outside as well. Ha. Huh. Now, I don't quite understand something here. If we wait here for a while, maybe we'll see it. I don't know exactly what triggers it. But every now and again, there will be a gunshot. There we go, gunshot. But I don't know who, there we go. I don't know who is actually firing. And I'm not sure. Well, actually, I've just thought about it and I've just worked it out. But as far as I know, they don't actually ever hit you. But somebody has gone mad. And is going around shooting all of the guests. Which, you know, probably for the best. Anyway, we need to get down into the underground. So we can charge this battery. Now, if you remember, there's an underwhelming machine down below. That we can use to charge the sucker up. <clears throat> so, woo. Let's go down below. I actually forget where this is. Right, let's have a little look on the map here. I believe it's not Route Saturday. Now, also, if you look at our inventory. It's finally full up. And I actually like that. I like the, f the way it actually does fill. Right. It wasn't Route Saturday. No. Oh, there's some shotgun shells there. But I'm pretty sure we're full. We are. And there's some flame of fuel there. Oh, we're full of flame of fuel. Curious. Right. Now, where was that bloody battery charger? So somebody is upstairs walking around with a gun. Tying up loose ends. Who could that be? Let's see if anyone can guess. Uh, nope, not there. Was it Route Friday? Maybe? Nope. Ah, the acid has started again. So even though we turned it on, somebody... I guess somebody turned it back on. So, I guess they don't want that to regenerate. Or they're just experimenting with how to stop it. I don't know. Nope. Yeah, man. So, Route Wednesday. Wasn't Route Wednesday the save room? It was the save room. And considering we are out of time, 
once more. We're going to make use of the save room. I have a feeling that the next video is going to be the final video. At least before the bonus, anyway. So, I'm going to leave this one here, guys. Thank you very much for watching. When we get back, well, I think we're going to finish the game. So, till then, guys. Till then.